culinary hub presents restaurant style chicken tikka masala a gastronomical delight that you can easily prepare at home using our simple recipe i have kept the ingredients ready please check the description for the details and kindly subscribe to the channel to start with let me sprinkle salt over the chicken chunks followed by adding red chili powder i'm using kashmiri chili powder then i'll add half the amount of coriander seed powder and retain the other half for the gravy then in goes turmeric for the beautiful golden color then i'll add roasted cumin seed powder the secret of today's recipe is the homemade chicken tikka masala we have already uploaded a video kindly check the link then i'll squeeze a good amount of fresh lemon then in goes thick yogurt the yogurt and the lemon tenderizes the meat then for the moisture i'll add a little amount of cooking oil mix up thoroughly meanwhile i'm preparing ginger and garlic paste i'll include that as well for marination After mixing it up thoroughly, I'll allow it to marinate for four to five hours. Now it's the time for cooking. Let me heat up cooking oil, then start frying the prepared chicken tikka pieces. The golden chunks of this chicken, immersed in a flavorful sauce. is an irresistible recipe for your family once the chicken is fried to get a nice smoky charred flavor as you get in the restaurant i have a simple technique i'll be transferring the prepared chicken tikka over a wire mesh and heating it directly over the flame to get little brown spots and a smoky charred flavor Once ready, it will be the time to immerse this beauty in the sauce. For the sauce, I'll be adding a little amount of oil as well as ghee and heating it thoroughly. Then I'll add green cardamom, cloves, cumin seed, and bay leaves. Once it has crackled thoroughly, it will be the time to add finely chopped. onion I'll fry the onion till it is nice brown in color you can puree the onion if you wish then for a bit of heat I'll add green chili this is totally optional I have peeled and pureed the tomatoes let me add and fry for at least 10 minutes the flame is low then in goes the retained red chili powder coriander seed powder turmeric and cumin seed powder i'll give it a proper mix and continue frying on a low flame for another 5 minutes a little amount of chicken marinade was left over i'll be including that as well to the gravy Then I'll add the prepared chicken tikka pieces. Mix it and cook for another five to ten minutes. For a rich gravy, I'll be adding fresh cream. Mixing it and allowing the gravy to simmer for at least ten minutes. Then I'll add freshly crushed kasuri methi. Then I'll simmer the gravy for another five minutes. And to finish up the dish, I'll be adding freshly chopped coriander leaves. And the dish is ready for serving. This pairs up very well with the garlic butter naan that we have already uploaded the video, as well as the layered parathas. Please do check and kindly subscribe to our channel. Thank you.